So this particular property should be getting an extra $400 a month. Now, as you looked through the footage, I'm sure you noticed that the tenant, uh, you know, they kind of knocked a few holes in the walls. It looks like they really beat the holy hell out of the stair set. You guys are probably putting it on the screen, probably like up in this region right here. Maybe they covered my face with it. I don't know. I don't know what my guys are doing. They be changing stuff, man. You know those college kids always be changing how they edit the video. Uh, I'm not here to say you should fire your realtor, but dude, you should fire your realtor because if they can't figure out the MLS, whoo boy. Now she just woke up. Welcome to the Investing Properties for Sales Show. Folks, thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. People love Cleveland as a cash flow market because the rents, folks, the rents, the price to rent ratio, it's off the chart. And over the last couple of years, uh, rents have been skyrocketing, right? And I think this particular property that I have for you guys today is a great, a great example of just how much the rents have skyrocketed uh, in most of the country, but definitely here in Cleveland, right? 3831 West 40th, Cleveland, 44109, okay? This particular property I have listed at 44,900, right? Under 45K. And we currently have a tenant in there paying $800, okay? But here's the deal this tenant this inherited tenant they got in there before rents skyrocketed out here right i'm sure obviously no matter where you are right now watching this video right you're probably on your couch in your underwear with cheeto dust on your face but that couch and that cheeto dust and that dirty soggy underwear could be here in ohio it could be in dallas texas it could be in new york city it could be in los angeles i don't know that but what i do know is any of those locations that i just mentioned has seen an incredible increase in rental prices over the last two years. Hell, the freaking Cheetos that you got wiped all over your face actually costs a lot more now than it did two years ago. You know what I'm saying? With the, the inflation that we've seen, folks, it's out of control. So much so that this particular property that uh, a few years ago when this tenant moved in, 800 seemed like it made a lot of sense. Right now, folks, is how great Cleveland is. 1200 that's what the market rent for this particular property would be we are seeing properties like this get section 8 tenants placed in them for about twelve hundred dollars all the time that's like become almost like the new norm right so it's insane uh that you can buy forty five thousand dollar houses for like twelve hundred dollars in rental income coming in every month right that's kind of where we're at but 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 you're not going to be able to achieve that amount of rental income for $45,000 out the door. You have to pay the $45,000 to buy the house, but then you have to get it lead certified. In this particular house, uh, on the screen, I'm assuming my guys are probably putting it on the screen, probably like up in this region right here. Maybe they covered my face with it. I don't know. I don't know what my guys are doing. They be changing stuff, man. You know those college kids always be changing how they edit the videos. Uh, but the moral of the story is I should have that lead bid for you, and that lead bid's going to be just under 20 k right? We're looking at 19190 to get it lead certified. The lead certification laws in Cleveland are new, okay? And they have added costs to landlords. They've added, is they've added uh, issues that landlords have to deal with, right? You have to get these properties recertified every two years. So in addition to the runaway inflation the country as a whole is seeing, things like the change of the policies – uh, for landlord tenant laws in the Cleveland market, that has also led landlords uh, to increasing the rental prices, right? So things like this, this annoying lead bid that you got to deal with, are why landlords out there in Cleveland are not renting these houses for less than 1,200, right? So all in, you're looking at 45 to buy, and then another 1920 to get it lead certified. Who knows? Maybe you have a contractor, you are a contractor yourself, and you could do the lead bid for even cheaper than that. Uh, it's fine with me if you want to try to do that. Here at Holton Wise, we are a la carte. You can uh, buy this property from us, use our property management, use our property insurance, use our construction, have us knock out your lead bid. We could do everything for you, or we could just sell you the property. It's a la carte, man. It's like the buffet, bro. You want to go in there and you want to dip your fried chicken in some friggin' soft serve ice cream? You can, but you don't have to. You know what I'm saying? That's what we got going on over here, folks. Uh, with those lead bids, though, 
if you're new to the Cleveland market and you've never invested here before, you really do need to understand how that stuff works. Irregardless of if you buy this particular property for me or ever work with me again. Maybe you're just passing through Holton Wise TV and you're like, well, what's going on? Let me check this out. And you're like, eh, I don't want to invest in Cleveland. Or, eh, I do want to invest in Cleveland, but I don't want to invest in Cleveland with that dude. I don't know what your situation is, but if you are looking into Cleveland any deeper than right now on your phone, you need to know what's going on with those lead bids, right? Because I don't want you guys buying properties, uh, not understanding how these lead bids work, because they are very confusing, and a very small portion of Cleveland landlords have actually got their properties lead certified. So if you're buying and investing in the Cleveland market, uh, dealing with lead certification and dealing with the government is going to be a big part of your job. So guys... Investors that make the money are the investors that get educated and do their due diligence before they buy the properties. So no matter what, I want you to click the notes below this video and watch my lead certification video. Half hour long tutorial. Any and everything you need to know about the lead certification process in the city of Cleveland is in that video, folks. Again, whether or not you want to buy this house, you need to know that because that has changed the way Cleveland landlords do business. So that's very, very important. Now, with that said, it's changed the way. Uh, for the better as well, though, right? Because you got a little work, you got a little more cost, you got a little more regulations to deal with. But again, uh, that has allowed landlords to pass that cost on to the tenant base and increase rent. So this particular property should be getting an extra $400 a month. Now, as you looked through the footage, I'm sure you noticed that the tenant, uh, you know, they kind of knocked a few holes in the walls. It looks like they really beat the holy hell out of the stair set. Uh, I could only imagine uh, what type of savagery went on during the move, right? I don't, I don't know, like if they have like freaking professional wrestlers trying to move their couches and, and, and their, their beds and things of that nature up and down those stairs. I don't know, but man, they beat the living hell out of those stairs. Uh, but all that's probably going to get taken care of uh, during the lead certification process. So it would be up to you if you wanted to remove these tenants, because they are month-to-month -month tenants, and then just get new tenants in there, or if you wanted to just keep these tenants but increase their rent. I don't think if you were going to want to keep them, uh, I would increase it all the way to 1200 in one year. I think uh, if your plan is to not deal with a, a tenant turnover and a vacant house, I would say you want to go slower. I would say maybe increase it like 150 a pop till you get them up to 1200 uh, But that's on you. That's uh, on you on whether or not you want to do that because at this moment in time, you're going to have to do some uh, cosmetic work to this unit anyway just to get it lead certified because you can't let it just be unlead certified because that is now going to be against the law. New law, uh, but you don't want to skate against the law. That's usually a good way to get yourself in trouble. Uh, so up to you with how aggressive you want to be, but what you do need to know from me is a tenant only paying $800 a month for a house like this puts you in the minority. Most landlords are going to be charging 1200 bucks. That is the going rate for something like this. That is just the new economy we are living in. So it does make for a pretty sweet investment because I don't know anywhere else you can get 1200 for this type of acquisition cost. So if all that sounds pretty good to you, you want to make an offer, submit that to my team, sales at HoltonWise.com. If you want to pay cash, sweet, include your proof of funds. If you want to finance it, sweet, include your pre-approval letter. If you don't have lenders, just shoot us an email asking for our list of lenders. We will get those to you. Also, if you're working with another real estate agent and you want them to represent you and submit your offer, that's totally fine. Information on how they can do that is in the MLS. If they go through the MLS and they can't figure it out from there, uh, I'm not here to say you should fire your realtor, but dude, you should fire your realtor because if they can't figure out the MLS, whoo boy, that's not going to be good for you, man. That just ain't going to work long term. If that does happen, don't worry. We'll still represent you. Sales at HoltonWise.com. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.